And it's really important for people who get a chance to see someone from Google speak to learn how to fully understand what they're saying. Right. In other words, they're not going to come out and say, well, the way this part of the algorithm works is we bolt this thing on here, and then these three things happen like that, and these two interact like that. Yep. And so the perfect way to optimize your site is to do this and then get these two links. They're not going to say that, right? So what you have to get to is the way they choose to communicate and the words they choose and the directions they come from mm -hmm. tell you a lot about what their goals and motivations are. And then you have to step back and think about, okay, you know, where are they headed? You know, you have Wayne Gretzky, who's famous uh, quote when he was asked about why he was such a great hockey player was because he skates to where the puck is going. Right, right, right. You know, not to where it currently is. Um, <laughs> and, and that opportunity so much exists in digital marketing today, right, to do that. It, it's, so it's like intuitive marketing. What you're saying is, is that you got to read the topography, you got to read what Google's saying and look, I'm not so much between the lines, but understand their intent, understand the, the context in which they're, they're speaking. There's, you're ne they're never going to give you the, 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 the rules of the road, but you can certainly understand just by how they communicate. And they made it, they've made a science on how to deliver that message to us. And, and you can key off of, of a number of, of points that they're regularly delivering. Now, granted, they, they do shift and they have evolved what they say and how they say things over time, right? And one of the first things this past year, or I'm sorry, in 2015, was the mobile get, and that's the first time they actually came out in a solid, en masse, get your, <laughs> get your site responsive. But um, they, they do give some great points to, to listen to if you know how to listen. That's what you're saying? Yeah, no, absolutely. And then, then let's read a little further into the line, mm -hmm. on the, in, uh, in between the lines here. They announced the first mobile update. They announced the second mobile update. Right. And they've already told us that there's going to be a third. Google doesn't do that with a lot of their algorithm updates, so why do they do it in mobile? Mm -hmm. And then you have to read a little further. In, they have motivations here, and they really want the mobile web to be very powerful and very impactful. Yes. Um, uh, because uh, if everybody just goes to their smartphone and does everything on apps mm -hmm. rather than on the mobile web, that's not good for Google. No. Absolutely. So they're trying to really push the mobile ad uh, web agenda really hard. But a really cool stat, uh, which uh, Comscore published uh, back last August, I think it was. 44% of digital media time today that people spend is on a smartphone app. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smartphone app, not even leaving out the tablet apps. 44%. That's amazing. So if you're trying to reach your audience, 44% of the time they're on the phone on an app. Mm -hmm. Right, so Google wants to keep it from going all to apps. Oh, so. absolutely. So...